Next technique is RFC, stands for Remote Function Call. This is one of the classical approaches to access SAP system. With RFC calls, we can perform both read and write operation. We can use RFC for both asynchronous and synchronous communications. There are different variants of RFC based on mode of communication. Let's talk about each of those. First variant is ARFC, stands for Asynchronous RFC. ARFC is not read really an asynchronous type of communication. Using ARFC is always a good idea when a real-time communication is established with a remote system. For example, ARFC allows users to carry an interactive dialogue with a remote system. Next variant is TRFC, stands for Transactional RFC. Transactional RFC follows asynchronous mode of communication. TRFC is recommended if you want to maintain the transactional sequence of the calls. If a call is sent and the receiving system is down, the call remains in the local queue until a later time. The calling dialog program can proceed without waiting to see whether or not the remote call was successful or not. This is the primary difference between TRFC and ARFC, where the receiving system must be available for asynchronous RFC case. The main disadvantage of TRFC is we cannot control the sequence of execution of TRFC calls. It can have a performance impact on the system because RFC processes all the logical unit of works independently of one and another. Next variant is QRFC, stands for queued RFC. Let us take an example. You are trying to build an application and you want to make sure that the transactions are processed in a predefined order. In that case, you should always use QRFC. QRFC is a variant of TRFC, but it uses queues to process the data. We can use both inbound and outbound queues to process and maintain the order. Let's talk about the next variant, which is BGRFC, stands for Background RFC. BGRFC is a successor of TRFC and QRFC, with significant improvements in terms of performance and functionality. The last variant is LDQ, stands for Local Data Queue. The LDQ is a special case in RFC communication. Here, no data is sent actively by the system. Instead, it is stored locally until being called by an external application, according to the pull principle. Please note that TRFC, QRFC, BGRFC and LDQ uses asynchronous mode of communication. 